Gymnastics live workout. Really good to see that you've all tuned in. And if you haven't, don't worry. Again, I'll be putting this on YouTube straight after this lesson. So today's workout is all gonna be about the forward roll exercises. So if you can do a forward roll and you want to perfect it, or if you can't do a forward roll and definitely want to do the exercises to get a forward roll, this is definitely the workout for you. Okay, so here we go. We're going to start off with 30 seconds jogging on the spot, then 30 seconds stretch, three sets. Here we go. So jogging on the spot, same as before, just getting your heart rate going and to the side. Keep going. Little high now. Make sure your arms come back and forth. We don't want to see karate arms. And we don't want to see arms coming in and out. That actually turns your hips. So arms back and forth. You can straighten your fingers if you want. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one, and stop. Circle your arms backwards. Five times. One, two, three, four, five. Well done. Forward. One, two, three, four. Five, this is very important because we're going to be using our shoulders today. So arms up in the air and five shoulder shrugs. One, two, three, four, five. Excellent. Legs apart, straddle position. Squeeze, hips forward. Arm comes close to your ear and we'll do three pulses to the side. One, two, three. Switch hands. Look at your hands. One, two, three, excellent. Get ready for 30 seconds, jog on the spot. Three, two, one, go. Arms back and forth. Remember, we don't wanna see kitchen arms like you're chopping. We wanna see arms back and forth, high knees. Okay, keep going, well done, you're doing so well. And we're gonna go a little higher. Keep going. Well done. We're going to go really fast in three, two, one. Three, two, one, and stop. Excellent. Straddle position. We're going to do our hold and pulses. So hands, jello hands, to your feet. And we're going to hold for six. One, two, three. Four, five, six. Six pulses. One, two, three, four, five, six. Stretch up in the air. Remember when you're doing this, you want your head and neck to feel really light and floppy in your arms. So we're gonna go down to the middle. And hold for six. One, two, three, four, five, Six, six pulses. One, two, three, four, five, six. And stretch up so tall. We're gonna to go to our last leg now. Down and hold for six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six pulses. One, two, three, four, five, six, and jogging on the spot, excellent. Back to 30 second butt kicks this time, here we go. Go! Keep it going. This time we're gonna lift our knee up, but still picking your glutes. Use your arms. Keep going. One, stop. Now we're just gonna do three, tuck to pipe. Remember, as I've always said, if you can get your hands flat, brilliant, or your fingertips, fantastic. It's all about progression. So we go down to pipe, flat hands if you can, or if you're really flexible behind your feet. Here we go. One, two, three, and down to tuck. 
five pulses. One, two, three, four, five. Back to pikes for three. One, two, three. Back to tuck. One, two, three, four, five. Last one. Back to pike. One, two, three. Back to tuck. One, two, three. Excellent. Now we're going to go to our hands and knees. And this is a really important one, definitely for today, because we're working on our round back. So make sure your hands are in line with your shoulders, okay, and hollow. So we don't want a slight arch, we want hollow back. Head in, and we're going to lift our head out, arching your back. So head out, one, two, head in, one, two. Head out, last one, one, two, head in, round the back, one, two. Now we're going to kick our leg out for five, two sets. Here we go, so we go without arching. One, two, three, four, five, bring it back in, switch legs out, one, two, three, four, five, well done, switch legs, and here we go, one, two, three, four, five, switch legs, excellent, here we go, one, two, three, four, five, well done, I'm just going to sit in a pipe. This is our last stretch. Point your toes, arms forward, and we go flex toes, heels off the floor if you can, and point toes again, really pressing your quads down to the floor. Two, three, and flex. Two, three, and point. Two, three, back super straight and flex, two, three, well done, point your toes, so good toes. Okay, so we're just gonna do six pulses, touch your toes. Now, if you can get your chest to your knees, that's where we want, so, okay? I won't be able to, but you go as far as your range will take you. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, stretch up in the air. Make sure your hands are flat on the floor so you can gauge how far you're going. And again, one, two, three, four, five, six. Excellent. Well done. Right, we're going to start our workout now. So, we're going to do lunge, hike, press. We're only going to do one set and we're going to do six each leg. So, let me demonstrate the lunge. Hands on hips, again, pelvis in, squeeze your glutes. And we go one, two, high jump in between. We're going to do six of those, three each leg. Then we're going to do our hamstring and calf stretch. One foot in forward, and we go one, switch, two, switch, three. Again, six, three each leg. We're just going to do one set. Here we go, in three, two, one, lunge. One, two, three, four, five, six. Excellent. Turn, and we go one foot slightly in front, and we start head in. One, two, three, four, five, six. Well done. Now we're going to do squat, half turn. So if you watch me first, we start with our feet together and we go half turn jump to squat. Straight in to squat. Okay, we're going to do just six of those. Make sure when you squat, you're really pushing your hips forward and really squeezing your glutes. So here we go, start with your feet together. Then we go one, squat, stay in the squat, jump to squat, two, three, four, five, six. Well.
well done. Get yourself a quick drink. What you're going to need now is you can either use a pillow for this, or the two pillows is recommended so it's nice and soft. And we're gonna take you through some of the forward roll exercises. I'm going to use a band. You can use a loo roll or a toy, or to be honest with you, even your smelly shoe, okay? So I will demonstrate what we're going to do first. So you put your loo roll, teddy or whatever you're using, lift it up in the air. And we really wanna start with our tuck position. So if you've done your bad, you should be aware of the tuck positions, which is tuck, pike, and straddle. So if you just do that with me, we go tuck, pike, straddle, arms in a V. One more time, tuck, pike, open shoulders, straddle, okay? We'll do that one more time just to make sure you've got it. Tuck, arms forward, pike, arms up, open shoulders, squeeze, straddle, arms in a V. Well done. So, I'm going to need my band, excellent. So I will demonstrate what we're going to do, and we're going to do two sets. So our first exercise to get to your forward roll, you're in a tuck position, toes up. And we go down, and you're going to do a little crunch. So that's one, two, three. Then you're going to lift your hips off the floor. Keeping that nice tuck. We don't want to see your knees to your head. Nice open tuck. Rock forward to round back into that round back position. Okay? And we're going to do two sets. So, three crunches, three rock back to tuck. Here we go. It's better to go slow than fast to make sure. We are aiming for quality, not quantity for these. So point your toes, knees tight. And we go, our first set of three crunches. One, two, three, hips off the floor. One, to tuck, back, walk back, two. And last one, three back to tuck, squeeze, so whatever you have, squeeze it really tight, round back, excellent, we're going to do one more set, here we go, so point to your toes, knees tucked, arms tight to your knees, and we're going to lift our shoulders off the floor, here we go, one, two, three, hips and pelvis off the floor, one, Rock to tuck, squeeze. Rock back to tuck. Squeeze. And your last one. Rock back to tuck, squeeze. Well done. Okay, so now we're going to work on our standing up from your forward roll. Now, if you still have your new roll or whatever you've got, a toy, we're going to still do our rock back. So let me demonstrate first. We rock back. And reach your hands forward. And stretch. And when we stretch, I want to see that hollow back. So the idea is, for you, so when we're doing it, the reason why we have to begin our hands is so you don't put your hands on the floor and try and get up. Now, if you're really struggling, what you can do is have your legs apart. So let me demonstrate with legs apart. So rock back. I have my feet together. Then I'm gonna have my legs up apart just to make it easier. And then bring it feet together. Okay? So we're gonna do two sets of three. Here we go. So again, start in your tuck position, tight toes, 
hands forward and we go one reach 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 forward stretch and that sit down again in your tuck and you want to reach for something like visualize something here we go one that's two and last one three excellent well done okay shake it up one more set remember if you are struggling have your legs apart or if it's easier you can do it off something like a little raised surface so i'll just demonstrate while you're resting and you can rock back off a little raised surface, then stand up without your hands. So if you're struggling, use something like a raised surface, okay? Right, here we go for our last set of three. Start in your squat position. Whatever you're holding, brilliant. Squeeze, rock back tight. Not too, not yield your knees to your face. And forward, one. And rock back. And stand up, two, squeeze, and last one, and stand up, well done, okay, what we're going to do now is, I don't know if you followed our half handstands, but it's actually really important for our forward roll to have straight arms, so we are going to do a little bit of half handstands, just two, with your chin in. So if you have a pair of socks or a toy, you're going to put this under your neck because it's very important that you have your head really tucked in and your arms are super straight. You are going to need your pillow for this one. So we're going to do two half handstands holds, okay? So put your pillow down. Let me demonstrate first. So your sock goes in your, under your neck. Here we go. And bring your shoulders in. Open shoulders and hold. One, two, three. Back down. Excellent. And we're going to do two sets. Okay, of five seconds. Here we go. So put it under your chin. And stand on whatever you've got. And we're gonna hold. One, two, three, four, five. Let it go. Tuck. Stretch. Shake it off. If you don't have something to stand on, what you can do is just practice. Tuck, hand, and just practice that position, okay? And if you are really struggling, do do that, okay? Right, here we go for our last one. Sock in between your chin, nice and tight. And hand on the floor. Open shoulders, here we go. One, two, three, four, five. And down, excellent. Tuck and stretch. Well done. Now here comes the tricky part, because we're going to add the roll. Now, this is why you're going to need a pillow and your head tucked in. Make sure you do this at your own risk, okay? And have your parents there. So, let me demonstrate first. I'm going to do five of these to tuck. So, sock in between your chin. Here we go. So, let me demonstrate. Half handstand, bend the knees, keep your arms straight, ball, tight tuck. Okay, so this is to keep your back super soft. And we're going to do five. Here we go, that start. Oh, head tucked in, bend your knees, one, tuck. And back off again. Make sure you keep your arms super straight if you can. Hold the top. One, two. Excellent. Three more to go. 
Make sure your socks in between your chin. Bend your knees, straight off, tuck. Excellent, two more to go. How are you getting on? Sock in between, flat hands, bend straight arms, tuck. And last one, I bet you're really getting a sweat on now. Sock in between your chin, make sure you really push the shoulders, here we go. Excellent, well done. Okay, so if you manage that, brilliant, keep it up. What we're going to do now is just two forward rolls and shoulder presses, really working on what we've just done. So again, use your pillow. So let me demonstrate. Arms up, pike position, or you can go knees down, squat down. Hands on the floor, and up, arms super straight, tuck. And then we're gonna do shoulder presses. One, two, three, four, five, okay? Just two sets, so this is our first set. Here we go. Arms super straight, down to your tuck, head in to your pike, arm super straight, roll, tuck, excellent, now we're going to do our shoulders, make sure your arms super straight, here we go, one, two, three, four, five, squeeze your bottom, excellent, last one, stretch up tall, squeeze, tuck, head in, Hands on the floor, pike, straight arms roll to your pillow, tuck. And here we go to our shoulders. One, two, three, four, five. Excellent, well done. So now we're gonna put it all together. We're just gonna do one. So let me show you if you're at home. Stretch your arms, tuck, head in, Pike, roll, stand up. Excellent, and you can practice that at home. Right, now we're gonna do, finish off a little bit of core, our plank position, and we're going to do 20 second hold. Kevin's going to demonstrate a counter time. So we're going to do our plank, 20 seconds, turn to your side, and switch to the other side. Okay, are you ready Kev? Yep. Okay, here we go. Three, two, one, plank for 20 seconds. One, two, three, Keep it going. four, five, six, seven, <laughs> eight, nine, ten. Well done, squeeze 11, the bottom. 12, 13, 14, squeeze. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, well 20. And turn to your side. Look at your hand. Hips forward, go. One, two, three, Hips four, up. five. Can have your feet apart six, like this if you need to. Seven, eight, nine. Halfway there. 10. Well done. 11, 12, 13, 14. And we're going to switch 15, to the other side in 16, five. 16, 17, 18, 19, switch. And switch sides, here we go. Go. One, two, hips forward. three. And hips up four, really high to the ceiling. Five, six, seven. Well done. Eight, nine. Keep going. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Well done, keep going. 18, 19, 20. Excellent, shake your wrists off. Well done, okay, if you manage that. You can do more sets if you would like to. 
So now we're going to do our cool down, okay? So hands and knees. I'm going to do five head in, head out. So head in, round shoulders, and head out. Head in, round shoulders, and head out. Head in, round shoulders, three. Head out, head in, and head out. Well done. Pipe position. Squeeze those toes, and you're gonna get as far forward and hold as long as possible. So we're gonna go 10 to 15 seconds. So hands in front, try and get to the end, and here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, five seconds, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Excellent. And stand up tall. And we're going to go back to our tuck position. And we're going to do a pike hold for 15 seconds. So hands flat on the floor if you can. And hold. Head in. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Well done. Now we're going to do 15 seconds. One foot in front, then the other. Here we go. Nice and slow. Hands all the way down. Hold. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Stretch up tall and switch sides. Hips forward. And here we go, hands flat on the floor for 15. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Excellent. Okay, now we're going to hips forward. We're going to do our quad stretch, hand on the wall. If you don't have a wall, don't worry, hand out to the side. So we go one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Switch sides. And we go again. One, two, keep it up. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Well done if you did this workout. Please do go back and rewind if there's a couple of things that you want to go over. But please do be careful. Use lots of pillows to be safe. And see you again next week. We miss you all. Bye.